Hello world, I am Sahil and I was creating video tutorial series of advanced CRUD application using PHP and MySQLi prepared statement in object oriented style. This is the last part of the series and in this video I am going to show you the last action that is view a record in details on click of this detail button. Ok, so let's start. So here you can see the project directory PHP CRUD and inside this all the files are here. Let's open index.php first and go below. Here as you can see the coding of button details that is actually a link and I have written in href attribute the path with the id of that particular record and when we click this button then it redirects to the detail.php with the id of that record okay you can see here uh, let's i am um, clicking on the details of the first record then you can see it is redirecting to the details.php uh, question mark details equal to 2 and the 2 is the id of that record you can see here okay let's check this you can see the id is equal to 4 now using this id we will fetch the record of this record record all the values of this record only and so in the details.php so let's open action.php here okay and go below here we will uh, again here we will again use if a statement and here we will use its set function and inside this we will use super global variable get method okay now why here i am using this get very uh, get super global variable because when we click on this detail uh, button then you can see the id is passing in the form of a url okay and from the url if we want to grab this id from the url then we have to use the this super global variable get okay so here we we have to write the name of this detail okay because uh, this id uh, has equal to this detail because this detail contains the id okay so we have to check this using this detail so here we have to pass details and now we have to get the id so here we will create id variable and again we will use get super global variable and here we have to write details details okay now id is stored uh, in this variable now what we do next is here we will uh, write a query query equal to select a strict from from crud from crud where id equal to question mark and now here we will you uh, we will create another variable statement equal to and here we will use connection variable and we have to write prepare method and let's pass the query here now again we have to bind the that id so here we will use a statement and we will call a method bind param and here i will use i because id is an integer type of uh, data type okay so here id now now we have to execute this state query so here using this statement we will uh, use execute now after executing we will again create a variable result equal to statement 
now here we will use get visa now again we will uh, use a variable row here and row equal to result then we will use fetch a soft method okay now it will uh, fetch all the uh, values from the database in uh, associative array okay now using this row variable we will get all the values from the database and store it into uh, variables for each uh, each column values okay so here for id i will write uh, uh, b id okay b id equal to row and here we have to mention the column name and for name we will use b name and a row name and for email we will use b email and row email email and uh, for phone we will use b phone equal to row and b phone oh sorry we have to write only phone and last b uh, b photo okay b photo equal to row and here we have to mention the column name of the photo so all the values are set in the variable okay now only we have to create the details.php that is not uh, uh, present here so we have to create it so click on create new file and here details.php okay now inside this first uh, go to the index.php and just copy the same thing from here because here we will use bootstrap 4 for designing the details.php you can just copy from here to here okay I'll just paste here now we have to close the body tag and html now save this now go to back and refresh this page now when it, when we click on details then nothing is here except this uh, nav bar okay so we have to set all the variables to show the values of a particular record so here we have to include this action.php okay now come back to the body inside body tag and here we will create div container okay container and inside this we will create uh, div row row and we will use one more class justify content center and div dot call md and we will use six here and okay now here first we will show the id so for id we will use h2 tag and here we have to show the id so here i will use pid just and just write the just write the variables that you have created in action.php okay so just save and let's refresh now you can see uh, i have just uh, clicked on the this uh, record that's why the id is showing to the uh, there let's i i am clicking on this then you can see th uh, the id is equal to 4 that's why here id is showing 4 so we have to write uh, here id now we can just style this using class um, bg primary and padding to 
rounded and let's we can also text center and let's refresh this and uh, we can also text light okay here we can give it to margin top uh, three and uh, also in body tag we can just use class bg info okay info come back to here and in column we can use bg light padding to rounded now let's refresh this um, so this is looking not good let's remove this let's change the color of column from info okay now let's see and here bg light and text dark now this should be looking good okay this is fine now let's so other details so for other details we have to use h h4 tag here okay now for name we have to write name and here we will show the name so just use shorthand tag and b name okay now just copy the same thing paste sorry paste 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 now here we will show b email b email and here b phone and let's delete this and our only left the photo okay so let's refresh this so we can set classes for text color class text light okay you can style uh, as you want now here we will show the image so for image we will use div text sorry text center and inside this i will use img tag and in src we will use php tag shorthand tag and here i will v use v photo variable and here we will give some width of the photo that is 300 okay now here we can give some bootstrap class img thumbnail now let's check so this is looking fine but um, here just keep some more padding padding 4 okay so this is looking fine you can just increase the size of the image width equal to 4 okay now let's see so this is to be keep it 300 this is good okay now whenever you go back and if you want to check the details of any record then click on the details of that uh, record uh, let's see the photo is here the name sorry we have to change name email and here phone okay now refresh 
now you can see uh, id equal to 6 and the photo and the name email and phone okay so this is working fine so thanks for watching this video guys if you like this video then hit on like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel and thanks